Hey, attention crypto gossipators, things are about to get interesting. Remember, not financial advice. What's up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. So the Shiba Inu lead developer labels all community members as defense team. Now, guys, you know, that is a very, very important that we see ourselves not only as a community but actually as a team okay so we are creating a family community team just you know put whatever word you want but there must be some unity and that is what is happening right now this is why we're going strong so let's just see what this is all about how is this going to help us and what we can make of it now kusama says all shiba inu community members are shib defense team against fuds now, guys, FUD sucks, but it does exist, okay? The, you know, the creation of fear, uncertainty, doubt, all that crap that circulates around uh, needs to be eliminated. Now, Shiba Inu lead developer Shaito Shikusama has now categorized all community members as part of the Shiba Inu defense breed amid a growing FUD campaign launched against the project. The label highlights the need for all community members to do their part in defending the Shiba Inu project against the orchestrated propaganda. Following a, uh, speculations that the Shibarium code is a clone of the uh, Rainier blockchain's existing code, a coordinated FUD campaign crept into Shiba Inu community as the drama unfolded amid the propaganda. Kusama has been soliciting solidarity among community members emphasizing the critical role of collective support for the project. To effectively communicate this message, the community Kusama has utilized his Twitter biography, which he frequently modifies to convey essential points. In one instance, Kusama underscored the importance of commitment to the project's mission, stating, uh, if you fly the ship flag, it shouldn't be reversible. This suggests that members of the Shiba Inu community should remain stead fast in supporting the project's goals, collective community support needed. Subsequently, Kusama disclosed that he now considers all members of Shiba Inu community to be part of the Shiba Inu defense breed, thereby placing a shared responsibility on the entire community for the tasks previously assigned solely to the original defense breed. Okay, so here it is. If you fly the ship flag, it shouldn't be reversible and great job Shiba Army. You all are the new defense breed. Now, the defense breed, initially composed of 12 individuals from the Shiba Inu community, was entrusted with the responsibility of supporting the SHIB ecosystem by scrutinizing SHIB-related projects, debunking false rumors, and disseminating factual and critical information to members of the community and the public, among other functions. In the second installment of his Shibarian blog series, Kusama praised the accomplishment of the defense breed and explained that they were disbanded because their exceptional efforts were no longer restricted to a defense team having achieved a remarkable success in securing um, several partnerships for the Shiba Inu project. The situation with the Rainier code propaganda has been addressed by the Shiba Inu developers with the Rainier developer confirming that the Shibarium uh, team did not copy the Rainier code but only utilized the same chain ID. Despite the clarification provided and efforts to, made to resolve this situation, Kusama's recent labeling of all community members as defense breed underscores the need of every member to diligently scrutinize any future speculations and play an active role in dispelling false rumors surrounding the project. His collaborative effort is essential to project the integrity of the community's work and ensure its continued success. So here we have it, guys, you know. This is something that maybe Kusama has pointed out now, but I have been, you know, pushing this idea for for months. Okay, we are here, you know, not to only become rich, but to also serve as uh, a purpose, and that purpose is to keep our community safe for the time being. Because right now things are very, very sensitive. As we are waiting for that final piece of Shibarium, we are going to have to go through FUD, through attacks, gossip, you know, all, all sorts of uh, things that are, can hurt our community. And, you know, a lot of it is going to be false, lies, 
um, and it really does suck but it does exist and we are going to have to accept that this is something that's part of the system a part of how things are done yes it's annoying it sucks i get it but what can you do if it happens it happens and uh, you, okay, as individuals, as members, as those that, you know, are actually watching and listening to these videos that I make, you probably have a big interest in cryptos, you want to know how, how everything works, how everything is doing. So you also could actually take some initiative and try to eliminate the FUD. I mean, at the end of the day, you know, I'm trying to spread the positive energy, optimism, um, and all of you have social media, I imagine, and are active. So, hey, you know, put out the positive message, reply to the FUD, or warn others against the FUD. Okay, try to eliminate as much FUD as possible, uh, because there will be uh, evil individuals out there that probably, for some reason, just hate it. Whether it's uh, the fact that they're into another crypto, or because you know, they um, bought at a high price, so they're in losses and they expect to be overnight millionaires with Shiba Inu. There's a lot of reasons, but that just really doesn't help. And uh, if we can always be stronger as a community, if we can be the stronger side, then our crypto will remain uh, strong, simple as that. But if we uh, fall for all this crap and let the FUD spread and let other members panic, and uh, you know freak out then we're only gonna see uh, massive massive losses and that is not something that we need for example we had this code shibarium situation guys you know it's sort of really is a thing that can be solved in a matter of just you know a few a few days few hours but it can be solved very quickly but you know what happened um, people people panicked Okay, they fell for the for these big headlines. Undoubtedly, the news outlets are going to go out there and create these massive headlines. They need views as well. They need to be clickbaity. But this just caused uh, for a lot of people to uh, unstake their bone with uh, sell it, sell it, or sell Shiba Inu. Of course, they're going to be these emotional investors. So it is important to be, uh, you know, to spread the positive vibes and to at least inform uh, those that are in panic that this is all just. Uh, momentum okay it's all in the in in the moment but actually we have a lot of positive things that are going to be happening very very soon so guys as usual um if you have any thoughts leave them down below comment talk share your ideas all that good stuff masses also uh subscribe you know hit that notifications bell very very important and guys um uh, i just want to say you know from the bottom of my heart that I really do appreciate all the support that I've been receiving. You know, it's massive. I can see how much interest there is. So let's just keep it this way because it keeps me motivated, producing a lot of content. And a big, big thank you, okay? So I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.